What's up, the squad? Back with another video. I see in the title is going down. Make sure y'all hit that like button, that subscribe button for me, please. Y'all see it in the title. Y'all see it in the title. Um, I do apologize. This screen is transparent just for the simple fact I do tend to get blocked from these, you know, different posts and stuff like that. When you do have different streamers and, you know, different people, um, you tend to get blocked. So I do apologize. You can still see it, especially when I go full screen on these uh, things. But this is basically just showing how literally she's paying for, you know, these different TikTokers and YouTubers to, you know, boost our campaign. And this is it's not good. I'm telling y'all it's not good. Look at this video. Check this video out, y'all. All right, guys, time for some drag queen story hour. So about a week ago, I received this email from a group called Palette Media or Palette Management. Uh, and basically what they were asking for is $1,500 for anti-Trump content on TikTok. So they basically sent me this kind of like creator brief with all the asks that they have and everything and like do's and don'ts, like don't show any form of support for Donald Trump. And his oh, wow. Don't so 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 the don't so y'all can see it and y'all can go check this out. I'm gonna make sure when I when I click off of this, I'll, I'll let y'all know where this came from. Um, the don't show any form of support for Donald Trump and his allies. Attack Trump supporters for their uh, I can't see his fingers in a way a little bit. Ooh, his fingers in a way, and I don't want this video to go to go. All Allies glow. His video, his fingers like get glitching a little bit. Show funny Trump videos or moments without providing context. Uh, I guess this is the do's over here, but y'all can see different, you know, different things. But this is insane to me, you know, having do's and don'ts, and then you paying fifteen hundred dollars for these creators to put out, you know. Things about you know, who we got this 18 to 24, 24 uh, year old American voters have forgotten what Trump presidency looks like and what it is shaping up to be competitive election. year. we want to remind voters of the reality of Trump as president to make America great. I mean, I don't I, don't, I, I just don't see. I, I, I'm so this is so crazy. y'all. This is insane. I'm going to play the rest about of this Harris and her allies attack Trump supporters for their intellectual or personal values. So they're basically creating division and paying for division online, which is crazy. So me being me, I was like, I kind of got to investigate this stuff. So I started like emailing back and forth with the lady. So I basically said, thank you for sending over. I will review is the Kamala campaign. Is this for the Kamala campaign or for like a PAX campaign? Um, and basically I was able to investigate and find out that this is actually a campaign with future forward, which is kind of like one of the biggest super PACs and they have like millions and millions of dollars, uh, hundreds of millions of dollars um, for advertisements for the Biden campaign and for the Harris campaign. So of course I looked them up and I found out all this information look, 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 about right all there. the money that they have. And yeah, you can look up them right here. Anyway, I just kind of wanted to come on to show you guys that. Yeah. Hey, a real one for this. Hey, a real one for this because a lot of other people wouldn't do anything like this. And just to, you know, show y'all that this is all crazy to me this is all crazy to me that you literally are paying tiktok like you don't even have to do that it's her playing that catch-up game i gotta catch up i seen trump you know and and the crazy thing about the crazy thing about it all this when when trump was with aiden doing that first of all aiden is into that you know type you know content and stuff like that this isn't the first time trump has done that though that's what people aren't realizing you know, this is not the first time Trump has done that with, you know, a streamer. I've seen him, you know, talk. I'm pretty sure, you know, because the Nelk boys love him a lot, too. But this isn't the first. Even if it was his first time, she's literally trying to play catch up by paying other creators. You know, it, it's it's definitely insane. And this channel is um, is D W H T H E D I V E R capital M I. Um, So. Y'all can check that out. And then this clip is by Insurrection Barbie. Uh, you know, this is... Uh, boy, I'll tell y'all. Trump posts from OnlyFans stars, Brad. Now, that's weird. What's going on here? Yeah, so we yeah, had a pack for the Kamala Harris uh, campaign or supporting Kamala Harris actually is reaching out to TikTok creators and offering them large sums of money, as much as $1,500. This was just exposed by the New York Post uh, for them to create videos supporting Kamala and opposing Trump. 
This, you know, might sound odd, but is unfortunately kind of par for the course. But what's hilarious is these PR people didn't do their research. So they reached out to Michael Doherty, who's actually a MAGA Trump supporting <laughs> gay OnlyFans star. And he said quite hilariously that I might That's do great. OnlyFans, but I wouldn't. That doesn't mean I'll whore myself out and my values to Kamala. So it's good to know he has some standards. <laughs> I think it's sad. That's it's wild. really it, it re that's this is actually wild just a simple fact like think about it y'all she's reaching influencers creators basically to you know get their viewers to see she she's she's is it's, it's all desperate you know you desperate to do this because there are people that isn't pay, that, that that completely aren't paying attention to your campaign and what you got going on i'm telling y'all i i literally have different photo uh different photos of literally her rally if if you look at you know look up a, a picture of her rally and look at trump's rally um both in georgia her you know when she was facing a certain way there were barely people up it, what i'm trying to say is she's trying to reach tiktok you know the 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 of youtube because you know she feels like obviously and we see that she doesn't have people focused on her it just goes to show you people are looking at the fact oh yeah well they're saying she black she black i'm voting for her she black not looking at she know you know not looking at policies not looking at this so she's reaching them other ways and this is the other ways that she's doing it they're not looking at the fact that trump isn't even doing this you know for oh yeah i need to get on this stream i need to do it's all I'm telling y'all. The way that Trump is going is, is the regular, you feel me, cool, chill, you know, smart way about it. And she's trying to play this catch up game, y'all. She's trying to play this catch up game, and it's literally sad. It's sad. This cl this this picture here just shows any A list influencers, celebrities who like to attend the DNC will get flights, hotels, credentials to the convention exclusive invites to private parties <laughs> and events happening during the week in chicago this is wild this is what august 18th to the 24th also i'm seeking top celebrities to do a post the post and the budget per creator is around 20k but we'd be happy to talk through if there's anyone with a bigger influencer man i'm telling y'all it's all about you know them throwing money at you and throwing money at you and and and, and, and i'm gonna be i'm gonna be 100 with y'all this isn't helping the people that's viewing these tiktokers youtubers celebrities it's not doing that that money is going to those people i'm telling you the money so so when you have people doing it it's, it's just all around is what i'm saying is it's a messed up thing it's a messed up thing it's it's literally sickening look at this any A-list influencer celebrities who like to attend a DNC will get flights, hotel credentials to, to the convention exclusive, making it sound, you know, and maybe they do get all of this stuff. But it's just sad on how desperate you are just to get votes. That's crazy. Then you got you, you got you got Cartier family in here um, with with another uh, video. Not this is one video that I made sure I had to definitely. Uh, before I even, you know, started it, I, I had to, you know. Last month, Sane says she was hired by Protect Our Care, a progressive advocacy group that relies on anonymous donors. She made a video warning about Trump's second term agenda. They almost help you script it, right? Right, like, definitely. She takes their talking points and puts them into her own voice, saying she always oh, wow. discloses. She Let takes their talking that. points and puts. Oh, wow. This is crazy, y'all. Y'all make sure y'all check that video out. ...into her own voice, saying she always discloses when she's being paid. What's your rate? So a video just for a creator in my size, an average can go from $3,000 to $10,000, depending, and upwards. Last month, Sane says wow. she was hired by Protect... All... Y'all, it's so much content out here. It's so much content out here that <clears throat> she's doing this for the votes and paying these creators so when you see a creator just know just know oh yeah this is they got they got paid they got paid to do it and, and by all means y'all by all means i'm not getting paid whatsoever i'm not getting paid whatsoever by the trump by trump trump campaign anything like i i, I promise y'all i'm not at all 
You know, it's it's not that deep too. And I, I can I can tell y'all right now, Trump and his campaign would not do that. Trust and believe would not do that. We all see that, y'all. Definitely, definitely would not do anything like that. Look at this video right here, y'all. This is the last video I'm gonna show, but I definitely was was creeped out about this video right here. So Harry Sisson put up this tweet saying, hope, dedication, patriotism. That's the Kamala Harris campaign. And then this picture that's supposed to be a Kamala rally, I guess, of her riding in a plane. The only issue is this picture is AI. This is not real. And you can really see it with the phones. And y'all can go check this out on TikTok, Walton Wisdom. Wisdom. And then the, the, the Twitter page is, you know, the interaction Barbie page. So y'all see it on there. But if y'all clearly see when y'all go on there, um, or, or if y'all can see it on here, it's, the, the screen ain't that, you know, transparent. But if y'all look closely at their phones, it's all different. They're like different colors. It's weird. It's not like, because usually when you take a photo, you'll see people's heads. This is just color images. Color images. That's all you see. Like they're it's all, all fake. Recording something different. It's none of it's the same. And here's <clears> another <throat> close up of just all the phones doing their own thing. Also, this person's thumb is oddly shaped. So yeah, Harry, if you're gonna brag about the Kamala campaign, maybe use a real picture. Trying to make it all look, you know, like it, everything's real. Everything's just golden for her and it's not. And I'm gonna tell y'all, I'm here to, to, to get out that, you know, get out that truth, you know, because it's important for that. It's definitely important for that. And I appreciate every last one of y'all, you know, doing what y'all doing, sharing these videos, liking these videos, because this right here is important. This right here is important. Make sure I hit the like button, subscribe, and definitely appreciate y'all. Much love to every single one of y'all. Catch y'all next one.